Breaking news in a public corruption trial of former Miami-Dade County Commissioner Joe Martinez. Local 10's Christina Vasquez joins us live outside the courtroom with the verdict just in. Christina. Just minutes ago, the jury came back and they found him guilty. And when that word rang out in the courtroom as the judge was reading the verdict form, one woman in support of him began to gasp and then an entire row of women began to openly weep to the point the judge had to stop. The bailiff had to sort of walk over and remind them to stay silent. Now the defense team here also asked for the jury members to be polled and each one with their name attached confirmed Yes, this is our finding. You may remember that this case was all about what the prosecution was saying was the evidence that, that the fact finders in this case, the jury, found to be true, that they proved beyond a reasonable doubt that he pocketed $15,000 in exchange for passing a piece of, trying to pass a piece of legislation that would have benefited a supermarket owner and a property owner. Now, that ordinance uh, never was passed. In fact, during closing arguments, you might remember the prosecutor telling the jury that the money stopped because, in their view, that money stopped. That's obviously something the jury through its review of the evidence over three hours of deliberation, they felt that the prosecution proved their case here. The defense had told the jury that the money, that $15,000 was related to a private transaction from somebody he had known for years. So what are the related sentencing guidelines for this? So you have unlawful compensation. So that is a second degree felony. That means at this hour, he is facing up to 15 years in prison. And then you have that conspiracy for or unlawful compensation that carries up to five years in prison. So at last check, when I stepped out of the courtroom to join you, the judge was with uh, both teams and they were looking at the upcoming date to talk about pre-trial uh, pre sentencing. So begin that process. And that date when I left was in December, December 20th.